This is for anybody who think that the refs will not steal a game or think the refs don't affect the game. You just seen it with this Syracuse and Clemson game. You seen it last week and you seen it again this week with this game that j just going off. Clemson and Syracuse. The refs robbed Syracuse. Robbed them with that damn uh, 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 what they call that late hit out of bounds on the damn quarterback on uh, whatever his damn quarterback name for Clemson. That was bullshit. That was bullshit. The guy was pushed into him as he was going out of bounds. Late hit out of bounds. Bullshit. Then when, when, when damn Syracuse quarterback was out of bounds, instead of the guy letting him go, he pushed him. Should have been a flag. The pass interference in the end zone with like two, three, four minutes in the damn fourth quarter. They called on damn Syracuse. Bullshit. Bullshit. He did not affect that guy in any other way from trying to catch the damn ball. Bullshit. These refs stole the game from Syracuse. And then at the end, they Syracuse driving, they hold up the damn game. So that is bullshit. Bullshit. Clemson got away with one with the help of the refs. And, and everybody's seen it, just like you seen it last week. So Dabo, like I told you, I don't like him. He's a fake and he's a fucking fraud. Clemson is a fake and they a fraud. They got away with another one. This ain't the first time this shit didn't happen with Clemson either. And it always happened at home for Clemson. And if Clemson just happened to make it to the playoffs, trust me, they will not get past the first round. Because this is some bullshit. This game is some bullshit. If anybody, if anybody, I don't care if you're a Clemson fan or not, you got to be blind if you didn't see how the refs affected this game and took it away from Syracuse. The refs would not let Syracuse win this game. Not yeah, the refs would not let Syracuse win this game. Bullshit. This is bullshit. And, and for the NCAA, for them to continue to allow these refs to affect the games with a bad call, play calling, not play calling, but they're bad officiating is bullshit. The NCAA is not doing anything about it. Nothing. Nothing. But for this damn Syracuse head coach, what does he do on the sidelines? Evidently nothing. He has no emotions. He stands there and look around and don't say shit. I mean, oh my goodness, man. Oh my goodness. He should be getting in the ref's ass for making these damn bogus ass calls, even though it might not make a difference. He should be getting in, they player, in the player's ass for doing stupid shit like while the quarterback was on the, on the, laying on the ground, he grabbing his fucking face mask. You know that's a fucking personal foul. That is bull crap, man. Straight bullshit. Then, the, the best thing that Dabo did today was bench DJ. Because if DJ would have stayed in the game, the refs wouldn't have been able to help him then. Say, so he made a good decision on with that. Clemson had four turnovers. Three by Duke DJ. Damn shame. Two interceptions and a fumble. So Syracuse still had the chance to win the game, and they should have won the game. And the refs should have called it straight down the middle. If you're going to call the goddamn roughing, roughing or, or late hit out of bounds on fucking Syracuse guy, when he was just blocked into the guy, you definitely should have called late hit out of bounds or unnecessary roughness on the Clemson guy. He pushed, he had the man still held up when he was out of bounds. A full yard and a half out of bounds and he'd go push it. And they didn't call shit. Straight bullshit. But it is what it is. I guess that's how the cookie crumbles sometimes. But it's some damn bullshit.
You might not like it, Clemson fans, but it's a damn fact. It is a fact. You got away with one with the help of the refs because you didn't do it all on your own. But trust me, Dabo Sweeney, Dabo Sweeney, the fake and the fraud that he is, he's going to build this game up. Oh, it was such a tough game. It's tough in the, in the, in the ACC bullshit. And, and, you know, my team played this and my team did that. Your team didn't do a damn thing. The refs did it for y'all. Plain and damn simple. But I, like they say, a win is a win no matter how you get it, even if it's given to you by the refs. So Clemson Tigers, you are, you are another one. You are another one. I don't have no respect for you or your damn coach. Because y'all are fake. Y'all some fakes and some frauds too. I know I know Dabo. He got more wins than Jimbo Fisher. And he done went farther than Jimbo Fisher. He done won two national championships in, in, in the playoff era. But Dabo is a damn fraud just like Jimbo Fisher. I'm going to put him in the same damn category. And you know he a fraud. Good thing about it, Clemson, if they do make it to the playoffs, they will not get past the first round. You can believe that. And with this performance and with the help of the refs, they should drop in their rankings. But we know they're not because Syracuse is ranked number 14. We know they ain't going to drop because they played a ranked team. Even if they they did, they probably still wouldn't rank Clemson. I mean, drop Clemson. But it's all good. Clemson, your day coming. You can believe that. Your day is coming. And I hope when that day comes, you just get the brakes straight beat off you. Because you didn't deserve this win. You shouldn't have got it. Mm, 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 mm. I would be appalled. Appalled. If I knew deep down in my heart, the only way my Alabama Crimson Tide can win a game is with the help of the refs. And I know y'all gonna say, y'all always get the help of the refs. Y'all, bullshit. The shit was blatant. Blatant favoritism by the refs. Just like it was last week. And you will, you all know what game I'm talking about. Blatant. Blatant help from the refs. Mm, 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 mm. But Clemson, I ain't going to congratulate you on this win because you didn't earn it. But you take this win and you ride off into, into the sunset. Syracuse, you played hard. Them players played hard. And those players, Syracuse players won this game. Regardless of what the scoreboard say. So, it is what it is. And roll damn tide.